Uh, one final call from Siobhan, then i got to take a break. Siobhan, you're on the air. Hello? Hey, Siobhan. Hey, dude, how's it going? Good. Hey, I've been pretty depressed lately, and I've been wondering... With good reason. <laughs> huh? I don't blame Just you. Just lately? <laughs> Why, that guy who fucked you hasn't called? <laughs> well, of course not, you know? And that got, got like me wondering, like, do you really hate me or something? That Why? That hooked me up with that guy? No, you said to me you wanted to feel a human penis inside of you, and I said it's never going to happen unless I sort of, like, help, you know, get someone from the audience who's willing to do me a favor. I know, but you, you know. always, like, for all those other worse whack packers, you got them, like, hot porn stars. Oh, stop it. I, I can't control who... Siobhan, you're a pretty scary individual. I mean... Why? You... I am not. Dude, you're a man who cut his penis off and had it shaped into a vagina. I understand no, what that not. is. I mean, and it's not like you're one of those freaky... And it's not like you're one of those freaky baby. guys who looks really good as a woman. I mean, you look like a dude. The pussy. I mean, think about that. I don't look like it. Do you wish you had your penis back? Be honest. No, I hated it. And this was the first time she so ever tried miserable. it out. I was no. so miserable. And dude, I, I mean, how could you say I hate you? I got you a guy to at least put his penis inside of you. Yeah, but then you also sent Richard and, and he fucked it all up. <laughs> well, he threw up. He couldn't help Well, that, he shouldn't have well. come then. Well, what, 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 he's supposed to know that seeing you naked with a penis in your fake <laughs> vagina is going to not make him nauseous? He throws I, up at anything. Yeah, well. It just, like, ruined the whole thing. The guy was... Uh, now, what ruined vagina. the whole thing is, is that you don't have a real vagina. No, I do have a real vagina. Ah, uh, Siobhan, vagina. I love you, pal, but you know what, it, it, dude... See, I don't know if you do, because love... I don't know, love implies caring, that you care about the person. I care about you. That's but what not, am I going to do? How come you can't, you can't get me a job there? Dude... What do you mean? Caring means I'm in charge of getting you things? No, it means that you would... I can't get you a job get, there because I don't have a job for a, people who just want free money, who aren't really trained I'm professionals. I'm not about free money. I can but, work. Well, dude, I don't have a job for you. People don't get jobs here like that. Like, I don't do pick people out and just give them jobs. Who would take me on? I don't have a job for you. What job do, do you do? Do you know an agent who would No, take what do you do? Voiceovers, anything. Voiceovers? What do you think? Like, if, if everyone could do voiceover, don't you think we'd all be doing it? You yeah. gotta go out, you gotta go out and audition. There's auditions in the back of, um, Variety, Variety and, and backstage, Hollywood backstage, reporter, backstage. I don't and have an agent. I don't have You don't, but what do you think? You think any, any person starting out in the business has an agent? What do you think? They just hand you an agent? You gotta go out and audition no, and get I was work. I'm wondering if you guys knew anybody who could help me. No, no one can help you. How about, I know someone who can help you. You! Go out and do these things. Go get yeah. Backstage Magazine and go out on auditions. You want to be an actor and you want to be in voiceover, and then you got to go take classes and you got to you got to study. You got to learn how to to do character voices and you got to go out and audition. Are, are all your guys like who are doing the lighting this weekend? Are they all union? These are guys who work in the television industry. Yeah, but they still need people to lug cables and shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a job where you just lug around a cable. I was going to say, what do you want to do? What would you want to do up here? Creative or manual yeah, labor? Anything. <laughs> anything. Like, 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 we have a job that says, do anything. <laughs> well, yeah, it's, it's, it's outrageous. How would I help you with that? I mean, who do you think helped me? You think, what do you think? What do you think? I was some guy who, who everybody wanted to hire? I got out of college. I almost had a nervous breakdown. I was I know, like, what am I going to do? The trouble is, I'm not out of college. I'm Believe me, college old. didn't help me. Well, that, that's how am I going to help you? That's working against me so bad. Right? Well, why didn't you plan when you were 20? I jobs that I used to do because they just hire kids for those now. Well, what was your jo job when you, got, when, you, when you were 20? I was, I was doing what they called it a Gumby. I, I'd work for a scenic design company and well, load in sets and set up. Well, and that's what you should go. Then go stuff. back and do that. I can't. They only hire kids. And anyway, my back, I can't actually do that. Well, then you see, so you can't do anything. You got a bad back. See, and then you're asking to lug cables yeah. and lights. And then we'll, you'll be up here, I can't do that. I got a can't bad back. Don't start whining if you get up here. I swear to Christ. <laughs> and then you call in with dopey. I want to be your security well, well, guard. Then, you don't have any experience. Uh, then there's the other thing. You, you never, like, invite me to any of the roasts or anything like that. Well, what are you going to do on a roast? I guess there's an audience member. Why would I invite you? I have people who call in on a regular basis. She'd be great. Try to oh, yeah. On the dance. Uh, it's like, yeah, I go and make you your own little special porn film. And that's... I mean, Siobhan, I'm not, you're not my charity case that I sit and think about all day. Everybody wants me to help of them. Course, of course 
course you don't think about anybody all day. No, I think about a lot of people. I've got family, I've got friends, right. I've got co-workers. Well, I have a lot of people I think about all day. I don't think about you all day. I'm sorry. I'm not your family. I don't love you. You shouldn't say that then. You should say, Siobhan, I don't give a shit about you. I didn't say I didn't give a shit about you. I give a shit about any person. It's somewhere in between not giving shit about you and loving you. Right. Siobhan, you have a family, I assume. No, I don't. Well, then that's not my fault. Well, no, that's how you conducted I'm your life. It is, but, you know, if you throw that word around as loosely as you do, then, you know... Siobhan, I'm trying not to insult you. You, lead people you said to me, do you love me? Do you love me? No, I'm not in love with you. No, not that way. But then why do you say it? Oh, my God. Because you're pressing me and driving me fucking yeah, nuts. You do it. You do it. It's. I think you do it. To, like, goad me to do these things for your show. You don't have you to do anything for my show. You called me from. and said you wanted to get laid. And I got it for you. Yeah, we didn't suggest this but, to you. So now, now, why would I want to do anything for you? I did something for you, and now you're on here saying do more for me. And, and, and no, you know, no, I've like done more for you than most people. That, you need, that, that guy wasn't even, like, it wasn't even a thing that happened practically. Siobhan, there's nobody else who wants to fuck you. I'm sorry. I know. And Brad it, Pitt didn't call in when he heard you were available. Huh? She's like, why don't you get me a better guy? What better guy do I have? What do you think I have in my back pocket? I have guys Look who want to fuck up. how many guys we tried and know, people you know, just didn't show up. I just, as I said before, when, whenever... This is insane. For, one of, for Eric or anybody else, it was always some gorgeous <sighs> porn star. No. Why couldn't you find a decent porn guy? Because I don't have one available to me for you. Siobhan, that was... He didn't call in. A porn star offering. Yeah, no one contacted us. We've been talking about it. I haven't had a porn star. I have, but no porn star has called me and said, "Do you have a guy with a vagina?" Yeah, we don't solicit these people. They call in because they want to be on the show, and they uh, okay. They say, "I'll fuck Eric," you know. I see. So it's only girls who really call in to solicit to be on your show. Like yes. Look, well, we'd love for someone to fuck you. You're really catching on. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Yo, know, Javon, too, I have a voiceover agent that I work with sometimes that I've actually hooked up some comedians with that I know and stuff. But even as a favor to me, the guy wouldn't meet you unless you had a tape of, of right. you doing stuff. Right. Like, And you, I don't have any way to make that. Anything yeah, well, of course, you, know, you don't have a way to do anything. You'd you, have to you, figure out a way to make every it. Every day you want to do something different. you got to concentrate on something. you got to train for something. What do you think? This shit just happens? The only person that ever happens to is Paris Hilton. And she's she's got a silver spoon in her mouth. Exactly. She's a, she's a yeah, lottery winner. you got to go out. I, I, you hear me talking about the early days of my career where I'm working 900 hours a day and not even getting paid, and I'm learning radio. That's what I did. You know, you figured out somehow how to, how to, to, to chop off your cock, figure out how to make a living. Same. I'm dealing with, like, severe bigotry out here. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot of gay people who are working. Fucking day. No, I'm not gay. You ever go over to Patricia Fields? There's tons of he she's working in there. I'm not a he she. Whatever the fuck you are, I don't know what you are. You That's another thing. No one knows what the fuck you are. To me. No one even knows what you are. Yeah, they do. You know what? You know what? I'm, I'm going to tell you what you sound like. Bigotry. I'm going to tell you what I sound like. Fucking bigotry, and just like listen to me talk to them. Maybe they would find out who I was. You listen. Most people who run a business. Are looking? They, they, they're called service businesses. You understand what a service business is? Yeah. Yeah. And they see you walk in in a dress with your bald head and bandanas and tattoos all over your place. How many places do you think you're employable? Right. Exactly. And you call that? You call your, that? Uh, your organization is probably the only one that would employ. Me. And what do you do? I don't have a need for you. What's your talent? What talent do you? Right. You write? Write yes, what? I write. Anything Wait a second. Anything you want me to write. Uh, anything anything you want me to hold write. Hold on a second. You think, so, that's a, you think that's what I say to Fred Fred? I need you to write anything you, you want to write. Yeah, this guy has a very specific talent. Howard. He's a funny comedy writer who jibes with me. I mean, what do you think? I got unlimited budget over here to hire people as a charity case? Okay. You haven't done a day of radio. You haven't... You, you don't write... No, you I haven't done a day on a comedy yet. show. You haven't done... You haven't done anything. So so man, then write stuff on spec. This is how people get jobs. Write some sketches. Right. That you how think did we'd Richard like. and, and Sal get here? Oh. Submitting bits. You got to submit stuff. Yeah. But Siobhan, here's where you lose Richard credibility. Richard and Sal walk around with a tape recorder and a, and, a, and, a, and, a, and a computer. They put together bits. They used to send them to me for free. 
And I, I got to hear them, and I thought they were talented. It took years before they worked here. Years. Okay. Yeah. See, you haven't done a thing. Bad. You don't understand how people get a job? No, you're yeah. just sitting at home upsetting yourself. You think I just saw so Richard came in and go, I need a job, and then all of a sudden he just started producing shit? Come on. See, here's where Siobhan loses credibility. Didn't you call us last week and say you wanted to be our security guard? Well, yeah. That wasn't but, last week. That was like a half a year ago. Yeah, and, I, and I'll go and I'll walk around in a business meeting with a guy with a, 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 an address being my security <laughs> guard who's never worked security before. That makes a lot of sense. Out of all the people in the world, I'm going to hire you to be security, and I got to be. So basically, I'm completely yeah. unemployable. Is what? Well, no. you can do phone work. You don't. You don't. You don't g apply for jobs that you're qualified, and you don't put in the time. I have a college degree. There's lots of people who who do lots of phone work and things like that, and you don't want to do it. What's your degree in? What do you mean? You want to drag art. a cable around and have someone pay you. <laughs> Maybe it's that guy where Jeff works needs another person to look at that no, door. No, <laughs> I was going to say, what's your degree in? And don't say a frame. It's in art. Art? It's in art. Yeah, well, then why are you not working art. in the art business? You don't even have to show up at an office for that. They, they, what did your wife Be used to do? Be a graphic artist. Graphic yeah. artist. Wait. Graphic artist. You do graphic artist on a computer from home and email it. Because he probably doesn't even know how to work his computer. No, I don't. Yeah, exactly. So where have you been? You're sitting at home all day with those cats.